Hi, this is Simon Hill for Digital Trends at IFA, and I'm taking a look at the well-named Alcatel XS tablet. This has got a 17.3-inch 2K screen. As you can see now, it's just a prototype model at the moment. They're going to be showing it, maybe releasing towards CES time in January, and it's running almost stock Android on here. Battery's very low, so this one might conk out at any moment. Now Alcatel's putting a lot of uh, talk into the software they've developed themselves, so there's like a kitchen mode, um, there's a different family mode, there's some gestures that you can use as well. As you can see it's a little bit sluggish right now and they, uh, they assure me that they're still working on improving the, the loading times and getting rid of this lag. Now another interesting thing about this tablet is if we scoot round to the back, this handle part here uh, and the stand is actually built on, you can pick it up and carry it around the house is the idea and it is really heavy, really heavy. Uh, this is metal here, there's a strange little pop out bit here, two USB ports, in case you want to add accessories in I guess, there's a headphone port in the bottom, you'll also find a magnetic charger and then as you can see here there's a speaker and a speaker there, three watt speakers. They're actually pretty loud, even on the show floor when it's loud. Uh, I, could, I could hear the, the music of the movie clip we were watching. Now, this is obviously intended as a family tablet for around the home. And uh, because it's so big, 17.3 inches, um, it has a 10,000 milliamp hour battery. Now, they wouldn't say, they don't have averages for battery life right now, but it's safe to assume with a screen that big, the battery life's not going to be great. Again, they're still supposed to be working on optimising it. In terms of price range, they haven't finalised it, but it's realistically going to cost maybe seven, eight hundred dollars. Uh, so this has been a quick look at the Alcatel XS tablet for Digital Trends at IFA.